Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. Well, good morning. A cold and a windy start to our day today, but the good news is plenty of sunshine to go around, but it is blustery sunshine is what we'll call it. Looks may be deceiving. Looking out the window, it's rather nice, but that wind is still whipping around and going to certainly be a factor right through the afternoon. But here in Lee Height, I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. The kids are out playing, which is always nice to see this time of year. We're even starting to see the grass again, but take a look at the wind speeds. Lee Heighton at 13 miles per hour, Honesdale 12 miles per hour, Exeter at 12 miles per hour right now, up to 16 actually. And look at the gusts we were seeing earlier today, 30 to even near 40 miles per hour. Now here's the good news. As we go through the afternoon, the wind is not going to be as gusty as we go later into our day today. As a matter of fact, it's already beginning to back off in at least a few spots. Now temperatures are in the 20s, but we better believe it's feeling more like it's in the teens once we factor in that wind chill. Williamsport at 28, Pottsville 24, Hazleton 23, and Sealands Grove coming in at 28. The Poconos, the higher elevations, we're actually still struggling to get out of the teens at this point, and it's feeling like we're sub-zero in the Poconos. Feels more like four below. Elsewhere, we are near, if not feeling like we're in the single digits in some spots. So if you do have plans to walk the dog today, we'll have the sunshine, which is certainly nice, but we'll need the big jacket, top layer, something to block out the wind, the earmuffs, the hat, maybe even the jacket for the dog as well. But the sunshine at least hangs with us, which is nice. 32 for the high today, but not everybody gets to that freezing mark as we'll sort of hang out in the 20s in some of those higher elevations as we go through this afternoon and the rest of this week, other than a brief warm up tomorrow, it's actually going to stay pretty chilly. So we make it back to the mid 40s tomorrow, but then the rest of the week and going into the weekend, the temperature struggles to get out of the 30s and overnight lows will even drop into the teens at times. The average high for this time of year comes in right around 41. So definitely a cooler week coming all around, but taking a look at our long range outlook, this is looking ahead to next week. Things are starting to trend a little bit on the warmer side. So it looks like as we go to the first full week of March, things are going to start to get a little bit more on the mild side. So we'll definitely see that next week. But today it's looking chilly. 32 for the high. A snow shower has really dwindled down this morning, so that's not a problem. Mostly sunny and windy. The wind will continue to gust up near 30 miles per hour, even as it relaxes going into the rest of our day today. It's really going to be overnight tonight that we see that change 22 46 tomorrow mix of clouds and sun. Then remember we're locked into the 30s going into the weekend. I know it looks ominous, but just a little tough fight with the cloud cover each day as we get it off the lakes and maybe a little flurry or snow shower as well, but nothing overly exciting Sunday and Monday. We're gradually getting some sunshine back and there's that warm up into the mid 40s and we can always download the eyewitness weather app.